The cold weather is not stopping the Nina's mayor's race from beginning to heat up. As it stands right now, incumbent mayor George Shirk will face state representative Dean Coffert in April. The two have been allies on issues affecting the city at the state and local level. And Fox 11's Chad Doran takes a look this evening at what it will make this race unusual as you decide 2014. Nina Mayor George Shirk has been in office for the last 12 years, and he says he isn't ready to give it up just yet. I just love the job. I, I love this community. It's hard just to step back and say I'm done. His opponent in the nonpartisan spring election in April will be a familiar face. State Representative Dean Coffert, a Republican who served in the state legislature for more than 20 years, says he's long wanted to lead the city. I love the city. I grew up here. I was raised here, run businesses here, uh, and I want to see Nina succeed. What makes this race unique is the men are close personal friends. Shirk once taught Coffert in his civics class, and the two have worked closely at the local and state level on issues affecting Nina. I think it's an easier type of challenge in the sense that you, you know kind of what to expect. Dean and I have, like you said, you, we've been friends for 25 years. Um, I think it's going to be a clean, positive campaign on both sides. It's going to be very refreshing, I think, for the voters of the city of Nina. Coffert says he believes the city is moving in the right direction, but he says now is the right time for a fresh set of eyes to keep the city moving forward. I acknowledge that it's going to be very difficult. I, I think there's a few things, you know, that we can, that we're going to differ on. Um, and we're going to do it respectfully. Candidates have until tomorrow to file nomination papers, but so far, Shirk and Coffert are the only mayoral candidates. In Nina, Chad Doran, Fox 11 News. Coffert also said if he wins, he would not seek re-election to the state assembly in November, but adds if he does not win the mayor's race, then he will seek re-election for the 55th district seat.